Senator from Wyoming, and we are on a quorum. Thank you, Mr. President. I ask unanimous consent that the quorum call be vitiated. Without objection. Thank you, Mr. President. Mr. President, I come to the floor tonight sharing the concerns of every member of this body to find the best way to protect children who go to school so that children can go to school in safety and parents can send their children to school feeling that the children will be safe. And after we've seen the tragedies across the country, I think every member is here trying to find the best solution. And I think that uh, the one that Senator Cruz and I have offered is one that will provide the kind of safety and security for our kids, for our schools, and for our communities. And that's why we've introduced this substitute amendment that we're bringing to the floor this evening in an effort to do just that. We bring this at a time when the nation's attention is focused on what has happened at schools and communities around the country and how to best address it. And as a physician, a doctor who served in a state legislature and now in this body, I've seen the devastating impact of mental health challenges and problems in families and how much that has contributed to what we've seen with these terrible acts. And so what we bring here tonight is legislation focused on safe schools and mental health while protecting the Second Amendment rights of law-abiding citizens. And with that, I would turn to Senator Cruz to make a motion to that impact. 